life. Thank you for your children. Thank you for the, on the behalf of your family. Thank you for the good health you have been enjoying. Thank you for his preservation over your life. Thank you because it is by his mercy you are not consumed. Many water are passed under the bridge. Here you are, you are standing. Many are the plan of the enemy. Here you are, you are standing. The Lord is your strength. The Lord is your power. The Lord is your strength. Worship him and glorify him. Is the over Missy? Is the over Eloi? Is the king of kings? The Lord of love is the ancient of place. Is the omnipresent God? Is the omniscience God? Is the God that cannot fail? Is the God that cannot change? He has been, he will continue to be the unbeatable, the unreversible. Give him the glory, give him the honor. The Bible says, Righteous God, everlasting Father, God, I want to appreciate you. I said, God, I exalt him. Almighty God, I appreciate you. your blessing and name them one by one and see what the Lord has done in your life. Count your blessing and name them one by one and see the goodness of God in your life. Count your blessing and name them one by one. God is, has been so good to you and to your family. Oh, I will all my heart, I will praise the Lord. With all my soul, I will praise the Lord. Give him the glory due unto him. My sister, look how God has delivered you from the hand of the enemy. Why can you show gratitude unto him? My brother, look how the Lord has kept you and preserved you. January swallow some people up. February carries sweep away some family. Ah. The month of March, March people down, and many of them, they are now hostile. The month, the, the month of April, I want to tell you, is the people will carry some people away. The month of May, what I will say, the month of May. See what happened in the month of May, that a lot of people, they are in the mortuary. The month of June, you know what happened in the month of June. People, you don't expect them pass away. On about the month of July, you, think you know what happened to your friends, to neighbors, to colleagues, that you, that you all see this year together, they are not alive. The month of August, here we are. The month of August, a month of divine visitation. God has preserved your life. The month of August, God has preserved your family. Ah, the month of August, God has kept you alive. Jesus Bless him. Bless him. Give him the glory. Give him the honor. Give him the adoration. God is good and is worthy to be praised. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. 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 In Jesus' name, Amen. Amen. Amen.
Amen. The line is broken. Uh, they're not hearing you, sir. Sorry, it's not clear enough. Let's call upon the Lord. What was want to be of circles tonight? The blood of Jesus to purge it out. The efficacy of the blood of Jesus to purify, to wash everything that the devil wants to use to hinder your prayer. If I regard iniquity in my heart, the Bible says the Lord will not hear me. My brother, why can't you ask the blood of Jesus to port your life? The efficacy of the blood of Jesus to wash you, to port you, to purify you, and to wash you white and as snow. Ask the Lord to cleanse you from every spot. Ask the Lord to purify you from every unrighteousness. Ask the Lord to wash away all the sin in your heart, all the sin uh, in your thought, mm -hmm. all the Language, let the efficacy and the power of the blood of Jesus wash you. The Bible says, Who gave himself for us that he may redeem you from all iniquity? Pray that the blood of Jesus will redeem you from the sin of loss, from iniquity, and from unrighteousness in your life. Let's call upon the Lord. Let's ask the Lord, Oh, blood of Jesus, wash me. Oh, blood of Jesus, wash me. Let the efficacy of the blood of Jesus cleanse you. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. The Bible says, The prince of this world comes and he finds nothing in me. The prince of this world comes, he finds nothing in me. You are going to pray. Whatever the prince of this war want to have, want to war against you, to accuse you before God tonight, you are going to ask the efficacy of the blood of Jesus to put out everything the prince of this war want to want to use against you. Whatever your prayer tonight, open your mouth and talk to God in prayer. Open your mouth and pray. Every thing the prince of this world wants to use to hinder your life, whatever iniquity, whatever thing the prince of this world wants 
they used to understand you, the blood of Jesus will pass you out. The Bible said the place of this world called it, he find nothing in me. He find nothing in me. He find nothing in me. Pray and call upon the Lord. Every property of the place of this world, you, you yank it out of your life. Every thing of the place of this world that one who used to hinder your prayer tonight, the blood of Jesus yank it out of your system. The efficacy of the blood of Jesus pulls it out of your life. Tonight we have solution to all challenges. Tonight we have solution to all challenges. There is solution in the house tonight. There is deliverance to tonight. The blood of Jesus that work effectively will work in your life. There will be transformation. There will be redemption. There will be deliverance. There will be salvation. The praise of this world covered the fire not in me. Let the blood of Jesus set you free tonight. Ask the blood of Jesus to touch your heart. Ask the blood of Jesus to wash your life, to purify you, to cleanse you, and to wash away every spot, every wrinkle, every blemish. And the praise of this world want to war against you. As are you praying? It's a night of complete deliverance. Are you praying? Call upon the Lord. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. We are going to pray because tonight we are going to spend some time to pray for all the prayer requests on our platform. And I, you know, we are going to pray for one of our sisters that uh, she lost her head of sister. We are going to pray for that family. The Lord will comfort that family. The remnant is part of life. Let's pray for the sister. Let's ask the Lord. Let's call upon the Lord. The Holy Ghost will comfort that family. The Holy Ghost will comfort that family. Let's commit that family to the hands of the Lord. He has been with us on this prayer online, and he has he has been in all our prayer meeting, and we have been praying for our head and sister, but God knows the reason why he happened. And then he has, the sister has gone, his elder sister. Let's commit her before the Lord that the people he left behind, the Holy Ghost will take care of those people. The Lord will come, come for the family. Let's pray that all the soul of God will take it out of their life. Commit this request to the hands of the Lord. Almighty God. Oh, Lord, we have sent message of consolation to us. But as Lord, we cannot pray as a family, as a, as a community. We are going to pray once and again, you know, on the same platform, on our prayer request platform, the, the sisters, so, uh, Put this request to her. He said, Thank God for, for me because he, she gave birth two days ago. We are going to pray for this new bouncing, new bouncing baby that has been added to the family. And it's our prayer. You know, this problem we have been praying for the, for God to bless couples, for God to connect people, those who are praying for the will of God in marriage, uh, for the wedding father, wedding mother, God will give their own children. And yes, she has come rejoicing with us and say that God has blessed her with the fruit of the womb. He even put the baby on the platform. We are going to pray for the family. We are going to pray that God will watch over that child. The child will grow in wisdom. He will grow in knowledge. Let's 
Lida baby to the ears of the Lord. Let's pray for divine protection for the life of the baby. And let's pray that God will take care of the family. That the Lord that added to the family, God will frustrate it. Amen. On the eighth day, as we dedicate the child to the Lord, let's ask the Lord God Almighty to take control. No evil will happen to that child. No evil harm will penetrate into the life of that child. And every plan uh, of the enemy that want to adjust this, this up, destiny, God will frustrate the oh, plan of the there, enemy. This child will be a source of blessing for this nation. Let's decree and declare oh, this child oh, that God has oh, added oh, to this family oh, will be a blessing to the nation, will be a blessing to the family, will be a blessing to the world. Let's decree and ask the Lord, out of God, seriously he was uh, having pain on his ways that he fell yesterday and break his ways we are going to pray that the Lord God Almighty will heal this brother he said he fell down and he was having a pain on his ways let's pray the touch of Jesus of God. Amen. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, Father, O oh Lord, creep up every heart, heart for the truth, O Lord, for this brother, in the name of Jesus. Jesus, 
In the mighty name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, let's go to this world. Jesus' name we pray. 
Amen. Amen. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Hello, sir. God of all grace, God of all mercy. Father, I must be the mercy in what is wrong with us. Father, I will have a chance. Show this picture of me. 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 status. Let's commit this person to the ears of the Lord. Every hour of the weekend in his marital life, the Lord oh, will be And God will perfect, God will perfect his will. Let's commit him to the ears of the Lord, that the Lord will remove the hour of darkness in his marital status. Let's pray the power of God will walk in the life of this writer and on the hand of the wicked, God will remove it away. God of the Lord, the power of God will locate it possible. The spirit of the Lord will locate it. Uh, in the mighty name of Jesus, every hand of the wicked in his marital life, God will take it away. And God Almighty should perfect his will in his life. God will perfect his will in his life. Let's call upon the Lord. Let's call upon the Lord that God will perfect his will in his life. Let's call upon the Lord. The Lord is going to answer our prayer tonight. The Lord is going to respond to our prayer tonight. And the Lord of God we 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 perfect his will for him. The Lord will perfect his will. His will is for him to be set to die in his life. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. We are going to pray for him that God will perfect the will of marriage in his life. The bone of his bone, the flesh of his flesh, you will locate him. But to pray God will remove death that is from, from his life as well. God will provide that wonderfully for him. Let's commit him to the hands of the Lord. And the Lord will perfect his marital life and every death in his life. God will remove out of his life. Open your mouth and pray and commit the person to the hands of the Lord. Brother, God will answer your prayer. Have faith in the Lord. Because your case, you're not going to you're not going to connect you. You can possibly be like this. See what God is going to do. Better what is coming for you. Better things ahead of you. You'll be connected. Your marriage, you will give us the invitation. The Lord will bless your marriage. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. We are going to pray for all those who are praying for the will of God in marriage. 
We are going to pray that God Almighty in heaven will bless their marriage. Let's open our mouth. Let's talk to God in prayer for those who are waiting for the God of marriage, God bless their marriage and life. Let's pray about the Lord. God, Almighty God, everlasting Father, God, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus, the Lord will do this. The power of God will do this. The power of God Almighty will answer this. Everlasting Father. Jesus name we pray Jesus name we pray Amen Let's please pray for one one sister sister Grace Onatunchi who is finding very difficult to join the prayer online uh, because of some challenges. I don't think he is not able to join the online. Maybe he's here with us, but I don't think so. We're going to pray for Sister Grace on Latunchi that all the challenges he may be going through, God will solve it. The Lord, as the Lord God Almighty, will solve all the challenges in our life, in our family life, in our marital life. Let's commit that to the hands of the Lord. The power of the Lord, the Spirit of the Lord, we visit him and the husband and the family. Let's pray for Sister Grace on Latunji right now that the power of God will see them through and all their heart desire God will provide for them. Let's commit that to the hands of the Lord. It was a happy time. Maybe after this, I may likely add her to the group to the group uh, meeting. Let's commit that to the hands of the Lord that God in His mercy will reach out to Him in, in the mighty name of Jesus. The Lord will reach out to Him by the power of the Holy Ghost, and it shall be well with her. In, in Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. In Jesus' name, we pray. Yeah. Uh, before before I call on Pastor Matthew, I I have about uh, six minutes more. Before I call on Pastor Matthew, I want you to understand that this month of August have uh, a significant uh, event in our life. You know. This month of August, if you go through the Bible, there's a significant event that took place on the eighth, eighth month, on the eighth days. A day that is eight days, eight months. You may say, what, what do you mean? Okay, I will, I will tell you. You know, in the Old Testament, in the book of Genesis chapter 17, from verse 9 to 14, it is mentioned that God Almighty commanded Abraham to circumcise himself and all the men in his household on the eight days as a sign of the covenant between God and Abraham. On, on the eight days, eight months, he commanded them to circumcise all their children. Now, if you call to the book of the book of Leviticus, you see how they start in, on the eight days as well. In the book of Leviticus, chapter 9, verse 1, it was stated that on the eight days after the consecration of the tabernacle, Aaron and his son were instructed to offer sacrifice to the Lord on the eight days. If you now come to the New Testament, in the book of Luke, chapter 2, verse 21 to 24, it has been described that how Jesus was circumcised on the eighth day after his birth. What am I saying? The month of August have a spiritual mention uh, upon the life of the Christian. Significant event took place that day. Circumcision, we refer it as sanctification. Circumcision, we refer it as holiness. We are going to pray in the day like this on the eight days. On the eight days, circumcise. On the eight days, circumcise. We are going to pray that the Lord will circumcise your heart. The blood of Jesus will circumcise your heart. 
call upon the Lord, that the Lord God Almighty will use his cynical sword to circumcise your heart and to purify your heart and life. Let's pray and call upon the Lord. Let's pray and call upon the Lord. Just we are all upon the Lord. On the eighth days, the son Jesus was circumcised. On the eighth days, God told Abraham to circumcise all his main child in his household. But I to pray that, they, that in our New Testament, the Sadiqah's word of the Spirit of God will circumcise your heart. We are both God, circumcised by us. We are both God, circumcised by us. We Scripture, the Sunday school teacher, pray for the 
Have mercy on him and restore him back. Let's pray for this person who was supposed to come again. Then the spirit of God will restore him back. Let's pray for his restoration. The call of God bring this person back home. Let's pray for him. He's a sad spirit of the child. Of the child. He's from this world. He's taking him away from the sight of God. And the wife is able to pray for the husband who has become a demon. Let's pray God will restore him. God will have mercy upon him. Let's pray God will, 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 will start for him and bring him back. Amen. He said, pray every spirit of pride and ego because of losing your position. Let's pray the Lord will the Lord will flush them out of his mind. Let's pray for pride of end because of the one in position. God will keep that them out of his mind. And when they come from the spirit of adultery, let's pray God go to the spirit of God. Because because of my time, because of the time, I I need to submit now the spirit of the prophet, the subject to the prophet. I call on Pastor Matthew to take over, please. Thank you, sir. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Uh, on behalf of the the group, all of us together. We are sending our condolences to our sister. I pray by the power and the blood of Jesus that God will be with the family in Jesus' name. Amen. Pray so that Lord will continue to be with them in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. And everything the sister has pledged, Almighty God will take care of them in the name of Jesus Christ. Uh, after this, we pray. Uh, God will take the, the family, they will enter a new realm in the name of Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. yes, Lord, we, we, God will open way in the name of Jesus Christ. Right there, everything that has been closed that is necessary for them, God will open in the name of Jesus Christ. All things that is, thing that, is mm -hmm. that is not necessary for them, that is happening, that is them, God is going to close it in the name of Jesus Christ. Let's Amen. close our two eyes. Let's pray for them. Let's call upon the name of the Lord. That by the power and the Lord Jesus Christ, Almighty God is going to go to sin them. The grace of the Lord will be upon them. The mighty hand of the Lord will be upon them. That by the power and the power and the Lord Jesus Christ, source of this thing. Yes, everything is in the hand of the Lord. God will take God and control of their family and their name of Jesus Christ. And the testimony continue to be their fear. God will go and go. We will 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 we the joy of the Lord of the Lord to be their strength. The joy of the Lord of the Lord to be their strength. All who all who are body now body now body to be the name of Jesus. We are the we are the men of the men who bring them to bless them. We are the we are the process of God to make it and make it a love for them in the name of Jesus. They will rejoice. They will rejoice in the Lord. The joy of the Lord to be their strength. So shall it be. In Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. By the grace of the Lord, we are going to do another prayer. That somebody in Nigeria that have been doing uh what to what we call it uh, uh protest against the hunger. hunger. I saw one church. I was so challenged. Their own hotel was so peaceful. Uh, uh, the, the way they do it, their pastor was behind them and they were singing and they formed that song that hunger we don't like and this thing is too expensive. They, they, they were singing. It was so, uh, for us, what, is, what can we do is just to pray to Almighty God. And as we want to pray now by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, 
God is going to God. answer our prayer in Jesus' name. Uh, there's something that always gives me concern. Uh, it's about the or, uh, about Nigeria. Is this? Uh, when you look at all the con- country that surround us, no one is developed. When you are talking about about uh, United States, you talk about Argentina, you talk about France, you talk about Russia. We talk about all other countries that surround them. They are developed country. As a result of that, that is affecting them uh, to growth. But when you look at them, you at like Nigeria, when you look at all the other countries that surround them, we are all of them too. They are under developed country. There's nothing you can say much about them that it can influence each other. So whenever I talk about this, I always think that how can Nigeria develop? How can Nigeria grow? When you look at that, about that, but something that came to my mind. Look at Israel. They are in the Middle East. Although when you look at many countries that surround Israel. They, too, they are developed, but the way God has brought this up is, is very special in a very special way. That even the Bible let us know that one of them will send away 1,000, and the two will send 10,000. 10, 10, 10, even that's not that all of them they, they are in the desert line, but they still have agriculture, agricultural products that's one of the best in the world. So, so when you, you compare when them with Nigeria, Nigeria, you can see that even no matter how other countries that surround in Nigeria, no matter how how I mean how they are underdeveloped, under develop, Nigeria, Nigeria can still Nigeria grow like grow Israel. Israel. Like Israel. Now, now remember now, the word the Bible says in the in the book say pray for pray Jerusalem, Jerusalem. Uh, for the peace of for Jerusalem. I pray for one of them that does that, that they shall have peace in Jesus' name. The Bible says, pray for the peace of Jerusalem, that those who love you be secure. I'm reading another passage. Another passage. May there be peace within your world and security within your heart. For the sake of the living brother and friend, I will say, I will be with you for the sake of the house of the Lord of, the Lord of our God. I will see your prosperity. We now call upon the name of the Lord for Nigeria. No matter what the situation, no matter what the condition, no matter the country they are dealing with, no matter the country they are informed with, no matter the corruption, no matter everything, from it is a new India, it is a new mark, it is a new generation, but the power that the power is that God will touch Nigeria. I want you to open your mouth and call upon the <laughs> God
many many family do not have to eat. In fact, Gali, that the people say is poor man food. Poor man is not a goal. It's not a rich man food. In fact, people are going through the before time in this nation. In fact, it is the, and you are, we are the people of God. We cannot compromise our faith. We cannot do what they are doing. We cannot do our We always depend upon you. We always depend upon you, oh God of heaven. Will you not remember you in elect? Will you not remember, remember your own people? We are asking for every child of God in this nation. You have more than 10, 8, 9 righteous man in this nation. And you told Abraham, if I see 10 righteous man, I will wipe away, I will take away all their problems away. I will not destroy them. We have more than 10 righteous men in this nation. Oh God of righteousness. We pray that the priest of righteousness come and reign upon the earth of all, all the citizens of this nation and from all those who are in the house of power, you know, you will reign and take over in Jesus' name. Amen. And for those of us who God has blessed already, for those of us who, who we have abundance, for those of us who God has really prospered, I pray for you as well and for me and for every one of us, may God give us the heart. Amen. We are going to trouble because it was the earth to learn to other people and to work to fears other people. I pray that we help us to not be selfish in our material need, but we pray that we help us to share things around to other children of God that are going through difficult times in this nation in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. From tonight, I pray I decree. For every, every family, for every child of God, God, God we send effort to everyone. Amen. 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 I see that God will send help to every family online tonight. Amen. And whatever the challenges anyone may be going through, I am praying for divine help to locate every family. And this is the contact for the people of God in this nation. I pray that you will provide for your children in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Nice. It is well with your family. Thank you, Lord. From tonight, well with Amen. your life. From Amen. tonight, the power of favor is upon your life. From tonight, I bless Amen. you with I bless you with prosperity. I bless you with open doors. Spiritually, physically, materially, financially, let that blessing protect everyone in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. For the hour of today, for the hour of victory, I pray continue victory, you will release of victory upon every one of us in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. If you have heard and you have answered our prayer, do you Amen. bring the glory? Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. 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 Thank you. God bless you all. We shall meet on Saturday. Thank you, Amen. sir. Thank you, sir. God bless you, sir. Happy night, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, God bless you. I have not said the